Oh my god, are you mob? <laughs> <laughs> I just want to see how this gravity works relative to mobs. So, I'm just gonna, I guess, observe them. And hope that they split up far enough. Excuse me, sir. What now? The Ark Society. One of Providence's more obscure outfits. I've heard whispers. A survivalist club for the global elite. Billionaires preparing for a global collapse. And now we know the Constant will attend their next gathering. So where is it? That's the catch. The report is redacted. No names, no location. So it's a dead end. I can't track them, not without ICA backup. Now, I'm no big shot analyst, but it seems to me Janus was the Ark Society's founder, so chances are they'll want to pay their respects in private. Rest Track the coffin. Worth a shot. You're right. It comes back in flashes. Fear, anger, but like it happened to someone else. <laughs> your gift and your curse, what they did to you. Well, I spent a long time feeling guilty about that. Now, I wonder who got the better deal. Yes, found something. What are we looking at? The ass end of nowhere. But this is where Janus's remains were shipped to. Our choice for a final resting place, wouldn't you say? Not bad. So we stake it out. Await the next gathering. Then we waltz in and kidnap one of the world's most powerful men. Without ICA backup. Like I said, it's a long shot. We'll take it. Mm. You know, 47 feels like a human now because he has a team. Yeah, I don't like it. Oh. I don't like it. Why not? <laughs> yeah, we're gonna see the briefing and then call it quits because I'm right. tired. Okay. I thought we were gonna save the briefing for next. We next could time. just put it in the next time. Splice it together like... How did you not see this coming? My god, we came this close. The old man could have buried us all. Our families. Do you think you feel more betrayed than I do? Get some perspective, please. Janus is dead. Lucas Gray is about to join him. And a cornered animal is twice as dangerous. Let's be perfectly clear. We were not exposed. The threat is neutralized. We are back on track. Even so, from this point on, we expect you to take... No. There is no way I'm doing that. How can you question my loyalty? In case treachery is contagious. Do you really want to do this to me? Is there a problem, Secretary? You... No problem whatsoever, madam. Here's to loyalty. He is killing himself. My man on the island confirms that the constant has arrived. We head out at sundown. Here, in case the crew get ideas. Why are you doing this, Mr. Gray? You had a chance to walk away. Why didn't you? A year ago, I'm working security for this banker, Cobb. Only to find out he's a Providence operative. 
I've been running for decades, only to wind up where I started. We've all got barcodes on the back of our heads. Most people just never notice. 47 told me about your parents. How did they die? Car bomb. Surrey, 1989. Company named Blue Seed didn't care to pay for the mistakes. But I like to think no one's untouchable. I'm... I'm sorry for your loss. You feel it, don't you? Unlike him, you feel it all. Everything you've done. It's a dangerous thing. Having a conscience. Neat. Attention, gentlemen. Our source on the island just made a critical discovery. The Constant has a poison chip embedded in his neck. A failsafe, in case he's compromised. Damn it. Uh, we should have expected something like this. So, we subdue the Constant before he has time to react. Not that simple. The device is remote triggered, and during his stay on the island, two kill switches have been entrusted to twin sisters Zoe and Sophia Washington. Two young, ambitious Providence operatives and newly appointed chairwomen of the Ark Society. Apparently, chairwoman. even the Constant is unaware of this arrangement. Right, change of plans. We divide and conquer. 47 takes out the Washingtons while I figure out a way to get the Constant off the island. It'll be tight, but once we're back at the ship, we should be able to surgically remove the chip before the partners have time to react. 47? Tell me about the targets. I know them from the Ark Lab. Zoe and Sophia's father is president of a powerful conservative think tank, one of Providence's prime assets. The apples don't fall far from the tree. No saints either. According to ICA files, the twins are pampered socialites who get their kicks from treasure hunting. Commanding a band of trigger-happy mercenaries, Zoe and Sophia prowl the world in search for ancient relics. With little huh? regard for local culture or even human life, they stop at nothing to claim their That's prize. Well, flat you damage they may be, but safe to say they have it coming. Uh -huh. Dude, total piece of Eden. Okay, so just real quick, I want to get a good look at her, but first off, what comes to my mind is either Final Fantasy or Dark Magician. And you, you tell me, you look at this picture and tell me that's not Dark Magician. Right. She's like the opposite of Dark Magician in color scheme. She's like a she's like a photo negative of Dark Magician. <laughs> okay. <laughs> like, come on, this color's great. Kill conditions. Whoa. Okay. M murder. Kill conditions. Anything. Intel. Everything. Got it. Well. Tuxedo. Ooh. Tuxedo mask. Got it. We see our moon now. Do we want to uh, pick lock picks? Always. Yeah, I'm starting to become disenchanted with the whole coin thing. But I love me some fiber wire. I might have to go with the classics on this one and say, don't worry about the pills. Hmm. We'll see. Yeah, let's go with the fiber wire. Why one? Why one is older than the other, and also Sophia looks like a man. Nah, they're fine. All right, they're fine. The Isle of Scale, headquarters of the Ark Society, founded by Janus in 1991, the Ark Society is the world's most exclusive club. Its plutocratic members fear the downfall of civilization, and they are willing to pay huge sums to ensure their own survival. Wow. Once a year, they gather here to shop the latest survival products and to showcase new initiatives and breakthroughs. Right. 
These gatherings are shrouded in mystery, so we have limited intel on what to expect on the other side of the walls. The Washington Twins are hosting their first annual gathering as chairwomen of the Ark Society, and the Constant is known to attend every year. Beyond that, you're on your own. Good luck, gentlemen. I dare say you're going to need it. Well, if you need me, I'll be in the Angry Dome. Right. I wish I had an Angry Dome. You know, when I'm mad, I can just retreat to the dome. And then destroy everything in sight and, you know, don't worry about it. Ah, what Come on. I see. I'm just what looking at... Us, we were just about to begin. I'm Good just looking at how, how it screws up my walk no, cycle. Goddamn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> However, oh. certain areas are off limits, including the keep, which houses the members area, convention space, and council meeting. Should you wish to apply for ARC membership, please be aware that such cannot be bought, only earned. All set? Excellent. Follow me, please. I'm not sure I want to follow him just yet, but... Hmm, look, looking a little linear. Yeah, why not? There you go. Enjoy. The architects use it all year round for ideation purposes, but tonight's the only time the rest of us get together. So, you decide on what to buy from the catalogue? One of the bunkers, for sure, and I'm curious about the cryo facility. I think you're gonna like it here, Logan. With a seven digit tuition fee. Not better. What else? Mm, this is interesting. Ah, yes. Zoe Washington, one of our new appointed chairwomen, has prepared a brand new official ceremony scheduled to take place in the upper courtyard. A stirring ode to rebirth and the enduring spirit of mankind. I believe that is it, ladies Glory and gentlemen. To mankind. Please enjoy your evening. The bar is right up ahead. So these people are just next level doomsday preppers. They're yeah. waiting for the downfall of everything. Yep. They believe that the war is going to end and they will survive because they have money and the resources, I guess. Sir? Hello there. Hello, friend. Well, well. well we've got a Stargate. Start. That's pretty good. That'll definitely make things easier on us. Keep thinking that I'm going to get onto a lead with all of this, uh, well, flavor text. Ladies and gentlemen, fellow Archeans, can I have your attention, please? Now that everybody's here, we're ready to proceed. Please make your way to the upper courtyard. The ceremony is about to begin. Thank you. I guess I'm just going to learn. Upper courtyard. This looks like it. I really want to explore, but I notice that if I'm using my instinct or whatever it, it, when I'm in that big crowd, mm. my frame rate tanks. So I'm going to try to use that sparingly. I'm sure it's annoying enough as it is. Yeah. Yep. You think they're 
gonna start soon. I feel like we've been waiting for an hour. <laughs> Do not eliminate the. Oh, sorry. Hello? I was like, stop whining. Yes, everything. Well, even if you're part of some super secret society, no one's immune to bitching. Right. Well, they're more vulnerable to bitching because they think they're like, oh yeah, I should have everything because, oh my god, are you mob? <laughs> <Go on with them? laughs> I just want to see how this gravity works relative to mobs. Interestingly, it's I It's a suppose. human blender. The human blender? Human washing machine. My R7 glutton. Oh, that's the constant. Don't kill constant. No killing constant. Got it. Variables only. Well, <laughs> I'm going to have to mix it up in here. Something's going to have to give before anything moves forward in this plot. Right. Hello. They said uh, once the money for is full. They need to f fill the bowl with money. Then the ceremony shall begin. I don't think any of was going to show up there, otherwise it would have shown them as uh, investigating. Oh wait. Nah, I can just talk oh, to this guy. This door is for initiates only. I'm sure you understand. Okay, see you later. Locked door leads to the castle basement, where the initiation interview with Zoe Washington will take place. But to gain admittance, initiates need to collect a number of tokens. Huh. If I collect enough Chuck E. Cheese tickets, then I'll win a prize. Well, or collect seven Dragon Balls, you can summon Dragon. Right? Yeah. Oh, hello there. Hello. Will you guys just do something already? You guys are the worst cult ever. Damn it. Okay, I got nothing. I gotta start playing around. I, I keep expecting that this is just gonna have something happen. But nothing's gonna happen unless I, I just... Do something. Mix something in with the pot. I gotta stoke these fires. But how? Hmm. Oh. This seems pretty neat. Okay. I'm gonna have to do a little bit of exploring. Good evening. So, do you need to wear those thing? And I don't. I, I don't know. Who are they? You know? Yeah, these white dudes seem to be the initiates. And by white dudes, I mean the dudes who are, like, covered in sleeping gown. Yeah, the, the pajama party. Oh. Okay. Anybody watching? Nope. It's kitchen, I guess. Are you trespassing? License. Doesn't look like it. No one thinks far enough ahead to do the math themselves. Evening. Hello. Oh, it really gave me the Assassin's Creed vibe. Like Final Club all over again. How does it work? The tokens are hidden around the castle, you know, like out of reach places like the ramparts. And the first initiate to collect enough tokens undergoes a polygraph test with the chairwoman. If you're deemed worthy, you get promoted to Arc member. Hmm. I could do that. So, oh. every year, aspiring Arc patrons compete in a treasure hunt to obtain membership status. The first initiate to collect enough tokens undergoes a private screening with Zoe Washington, which appears to involve a polygraph and electroshock device. Hmm. I suggest you join the fray, 47. A private audience with one of our targets is just what we need. So we're going on an Easter egg hunt. Except for coins. Alright. So we were on the right track. Enjoy your night, mister. But 
That's torture. Someone call it therapeutic. Wow, I knew the twins were hardcore, but this thing, hey. Oh, hello there. Good evening, sir. So I'm just gonna stalk my prey. Eventually, okay. dude's gotta go to the toilet. Unless he oh, drink something. to vomit. Hey, it's just this riddle on my invite. Seek the keepers of the gate. In the courtyard, they await. What else could it be? No such luck. But some of the Ark members that might. Pretty cool. I heard a couple of them whispering. They're definitely up to something. Got it. Thanks. I left early, so I didn't actually see it happen. Oh, he said something about keepers at the gate. And then up the courtyard. You need to dress up, but um, I do need but, to dress up. But soon. you can collect them. You can collect the token first, and then once you collect them, you can just. Not now, Marco. I'm kind of in the middle of something. That's what I wanted to talk to you about. You see, I had one of the tokens. What? How did you? What difference does it make? Look, the token is yours if you want it, but on one condition. Are you serious? Name it. Okay, here's the deal. I want a seat on the Titan ship, but I don't want to become an ARC member in order to get it. It's too much hassle and responsibility. Wait, you want me to buy a seat in my name? Yeah, I'm... No, sorry, Marco, but I can't. If they figure it out, we'll both get expelled. They won't find out. Don't be a chicken, Paul. No, no deal. A chicken. No, <laughs> Okay, so this guy knows something. He's got coin. So how do you stole with Kaj Kajit has wares if you have the coin. We'll probably just have yeah. to knock him out. But you knew that already. Yeah, yeah. Well, why don't I take that token off your hands? No amount of jewelry can improve perfection. Right. Close, initiate, but no cigar. Do you just have cur or do you just have tokens? Like oh, just you just have to do them. something. You just have to do something uh, with the disguise. Right. right. Can you lure him in here? I probably need to poison him. Somehow. Staff only. Got it. So, Paul Monroe, the venture capitalist. Does he look like a winner to you? There it is. Paul's basically a decent guy. Got honor, integrity, he plays fair. When that Haven corporate services scandal broke, he was like the only trader in New York who came up clean. Imagine that. So, not this doesn't look like a place I'd be allowed to go, but we're gonna go here anyway. Yeah, okay. This is definitely not a place I'm allowed to go. Ooh, no trespassing, actually. But I got a key. You got an axe. And I guess a Viking axe. Okay. I'll just put it right back. Oh, what is this? Uh, what? Oh. Like performance what? later? I is guess. This is a... Oh, you can now see. You can only use your. Instinct. Is this permanent instinct? <laughs> God damn, I cannot see a thing. I think this is uh, the performance, maybe, for later on. Take care, sir. Georgina Legrand. Vice Interesting. Hemisphere Airlines. She's your favorite, I take it? Ah. I, I gotta see mission stories, because this... This disguise has got to do with something. It's it's kind of a nice touch that it just makes your whole screen black and white because you're blindfolded. Mm-hmm. I don't know if it's uh, gonna be very pleasant to have my oh. game in black and white constantly. I don't know about you. But I'm not feeling it. Oh, he's drinking. Right? Yes, that's right. Now I would need to find poison for that. Now you you <laughs> you feel regret to taking those fiber rides. Uh, I sure fiber. do. 
I sure do. I think the poison probably be bathroom. Or oh. What? That's where I just dropped off that uh, disguise. I just gotta make sure I don't get caught easily. just need to do a little bit of observation. You know, a lot about this game revolves around observation. And maybe to a, a similar extent, just doing commentary on video games in general revolves around more observation than action. Interesting. You almost get caught. Oh, is that that guy alone? No, he not. is almost alone. Where do you hide him if you knock him out? Mm. I think I would have to drag him downstairs to hide him. him. Or push him off. Or I would just... Kill him. Uh, potentially. Or I could just knock him out and leave him here. Because that's always an option, you know. Note to self, always bring poison, no matter what. Nah, because it's always bring something. The fiber wire seems to be not very good, but it's just great in general. Okay, I'm committing to this. Is there any... where you can hide him? There is nowhere I can hide him. I can just stick him behind a wall and hope that nobody comes over here. Which is... probably what's gonna happen. I'll just save this right here. So, where's the place that closest to hide the body? I think there's a box downstairs somewhere. This what box is right going in front of on? these guys. Oh God. So, what is the where? Yeah. Wow. There. That's where you hide him. Yay! The other guy. Just hide them together then. Can you? No, uh, you can't fit more than two. Oh, no. See, like I can't enter, it says full. So you can't hide another body in here. Ah. Uh, that's annoying. But I have more soda. So there's these cords that seem to be going straight down. Then there's this. Generator. If I turn off this generator, someone will come up here to investigate. Which means they will pretend. Oh! Commemorative token. Oh, nice. Got my Cthulhu tokens. Well, that's good. That's progress. And just in case the game just decides to crash, I'll make sure. To save early and save often. Come, come away. Token. Oh look, gargoyle. Huh. Which I could potentially just push and kill somebody. Somebody, you say? Yeah.
Imagine having that kind of power over other people's lives. It messes with the mind. A dildo will forever be on my record. What? As long as they're paying me, I don't give a shit if they like to play <laughs> charades. I've seen weird shit. You know, Look at all these tokens. What do you have to get? Ten? Ten? I'm saving quite frequently. But I wouldn't worry too much. It's probably just a seagull. Not just the kind of thing that's been burning flat by the camera. It could be a drone, you know? The Chinese can make them move like anything they want, even a damn seagull. Before you know it, we got a security breach. What did you say? What did, China? You miss? what did you say, mister, about Chinese? That they can make drones move like a seagull. Seagull. The crafty Chinese. Right. I can throw these coins. Let's not do These that. are actually usable. I, I wasn't expecting that, but that's legit. So we just need to explore and find tokens? Well, yeah, but I also need to explore and, uh... <sighs> what is all this? These cords are just heading straight down into this room. I think you can shut down their whole system. That's a sug light, I guess. Oh. oh. Where's the... Close circuit. <sighs> Hate closed circuit television. Hate it. Oh. Got it. Well, if I just shut this off, then what happens? Nothing happens. Nothing. You just... Huh. There's the security, so can you... Like, erase? Yeah, you would expect it to be in this room. It says security! Look what I see, a shortcut. In case if you fall. Okay. I really wonder. There's, there's so much area to cover up here, honestly. It's a giant level. Yeah, just pick up whatever you can pick because you would not know when you actually need them. Why would I not want to have a plethora of hammers available to me? Dude, you need a wrench in one level, you need. A screwdriver, another. Why not? What's with that weird bird apogee? The annual phoenix ceremony symbolizes the collapse of civilization from which the Ark Society emerges unscathed and triumphant. Ah, oh, rebirth. I get it. What's new is that the master ceremonies will light the effigy on fire with Zoe Washington inside it. Huh. A bit showy, wouldn't you say? Hey, whatever sells. Wow. Oh. So they're gonna light her stupid ass on fire. Yeah, let's light her in fire. Feels good. Oh, that well, that works. Okay, escape door hydraulics. Should be easy to get to it if I'm dressed up as a security guard. Mm -hmm. If you recall, I'm the one who wanted to do this. Hello there. I only Hello. have to worry about that guy. And that guy. These coins oh, aren't coins. These coins aren't crazy hard to find. They're all indicated by candles. But my problem is um So, you kill Zoe with the 
flaming bird. And you kill Sophia or Zoe? Like, if you collect the coins, who you meet? I don't see nothing to worry about. Are you kidding me? If the pressure drops, the locking mechanism fails, and the water is locked. What sort of a maniac would lock herself inside a burning effigy without proper measures? The same kind who repels into an ancient temple full of death traps and poisonous snakes? Great, but still. Seriously, what do you care? If some filthy rich broad wants to flirt with danger to feel alive, I say let her. They pay for our silence, not our concern. Yeah, I guess you're right. Is that a woman? Yes. So this hydraulic stuff is the pretty <laughs> balanced on a razor's edge. So if they screw anything up, she just dies. So let's see. The cage in the courtyard features a hidden escape door. However, according to the safety report, the hydraulic locking mechanism is disturbingly sensitive. Even a slight drop in pressure could jam the lock and effectively trap the occupants inside the cage. Forrest, Molly, listen, you know construction. I need you to drop what you're doing and come take a look at the hydraulic lock for the Phoenix. I'm just gonna save it right here. Gonna save it over this slot that I, I just created. That's not what I meant to do. Here, we'll retry it. All right. <laughs> I gotta give him the old one, two. I think it's just the proximity that they're standing. It just makes them stand so close to one another. You just sabotage, like. Rather, sorry, this the proximity they are within Wait, one another. Wait, I thought you had so four tokens. To I just threw one. Uh, so, I'm just gonna, I guess, observe them and hope that they split up far enough. Excuse me, sir. He hear something? He. Ah, keeps getting better and better. He's the one who heard it. Interesting. Also, there's rat poison here. Oh, nice. Pick it up. Can you just oh. do it? What, I, I, I don't think they're, they're watching at all. Just try Possibly. it. Possibly. Yeah, let's save it. Easy. Easy. I could just climb through here. But I don't need to. That's the beauty of this disguise. And Although, now that's you good have to poison. Know. Do you know which guy to poison? Yeah, the initiate. Which initiate? Any initiate. Okay. 